Hey guys, what's up? It's me, it's Captain A38 with another aircraft review video. This time you are staring at an Airtran Boeing 717-200 in the 1-500 scale by Skymarks. Uh, let me explain some information about Airtran on how this airline came into existence. Airtran was formed around in the 1980s. It was a uh, Atlanta-based airliner, and uh, <laughs> they they had uh, numerous destinations in uh, the U.S. And it was in 1998 that Airtran and ValueJet merged. Prior to after the ValueJet Flight 592 tragedy in the Florida Everglades on Mother's Day. 1996 that killed all 110 110 passengers on board pushed forward to 1998 and Airtran and ValueJet merged now <clears throat> in 1999 Airtran got the the first of their 717 200s and a uh, and a number of our 737s that that they have ordered as well, and the Boeing customer code for this particular aircraft is 31. She well the 717 is powered by two Rolls Royce turbofan engines. All right, let's have a look around the aircraft. The stag ports, PO tubes, the cockpit windshield, and windshield wipers. Airtran and Southwest Airlines merged. There you see the L1 door. Airtran, and plus I have a little surprise for you right here. Elton John. Now, Elton John and Sirius Satellite Radio had teamed up with Airtran to have music on all flights. Before, well, before it was all said and done. Uh, you see Sir Elton right there and the registration number of this aircraft, November 927 Alpha Tango. I'll pair, pair us up towards the port side of the aircraft to uh, give you a better glimpse of the aircraft. And I'm going to bring the camera a little steadily. The two Rolls-Royce turbofan engines. Airtran.com on the uh, engine cowlins. Airtran. I'll give you a, a better view of the aircraft. I'll just pause it right here so you can have a look at it. Now, this aircraft has frost buckets so it'll be able to land and to reduce speed just after landing. It's a substitute for, for uh, frost reversers to uh, reduce an aircraft's high rate of speed just after landing. There you see the APU right there. Take over to the port side right here. Very nicely detailed. And I'll take over to the starboard side of the aircraft. AirTran. <coughs> Airtran.com, the registration number of this aircraft, Elton John, Sirius Satellite Rio, Airtran, and come up to the Galleon forward of first class and the cockpit. In 2011, 
Airtran and Southwest Airlines merged. And all of Airtran's 717s went into storage, but were later were acquired by Delta Airlines. And give me just one second. Air, well, Delta Airlines acquired Air Trans 717-231s. I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna give you a double review. So I'm with Delta's 717. The 717 was taken out of storage for Delta Airlines in 2014. And is now used on domestic routes out of Atlanta, out of Atlanta Hartsfield Jackson International Airport. You got the stack ports, PO tubes, the cockpit windshield, and windshield wipers. The L1 door, the Sky Team livery on the L1 door, Delta, the widget livery, and the registration number of this aircraft November 989 Alpha Tango, which this aircraft had previously flown for Airtran. Only Airtran, uh, Hawaiian Airlines, well, Delta and Hawaiian Airlines are the only two U.S. airliners to fly the 717. The other is Qantas. There's the uh, Rolls Royce turbofan engines on the port on the uh, port side. The Delta widget livery on the tail. The thrust buckets that you see right there on the port and starboard side of the aircraft. I'll give you a couple of views of the aircraft from my point of view. And I'm gonna take it over to the starboard side. The Delta widget livery, the two Rolls Royce turbofan engines, the registration number of this aircraft, and the American flag, since Delta Airlines is a U.S. flag carrier. Pearson up towards the uh, the starboard side and the cockpit and there's the L1 door and right there next to the, L to the L1 door is the Sky Team livery now I hope you enjoyed this um, this double review and I'll give you a, a bird's eye view of both aircraft. I'll take it down to the ground level. Over to the starboard side and over to the port side. Okay guys, that's it for this video. I'd like to say thank you very much for watching. 
please rate, share, and subscribe to my YouTube page. Follow me on Facebook and on Twitter. That's it from the Airport Lounge. This is Captain A38 signing off for now. Have a wonderful evening.